Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Today I'm gonna be doing a tutorial of FL Studio and it's based on the issue that your MIDI controller your MIDI controller, I'm sorry for my uh, accent your MIDI controller only plays one key now in this case my MIDI controller plays only the C key and I'm gonna show you now play the C key on my MIDI controller which is a Casio keyboard and it plays on FL Studio too but if I try to play another key on my keyboard, my, on my MIDI controller, like this is D, now it doesn't play, it actually plays the clap that I have right here, and if I play E, it plays the hat. Now you see here that any key that I press on my MIDI controller is recognized by FL Studio, right here on this icon. You see that FL Studio is receiving uh, the key or the signal that I'm playing something on the MIDI controller but it's definitely not playing on the grand piano which is my main instrument, my main sample that I have right here now in order to fix this issue what you wanna do is first of all go to options and before you do any change just please make sure that you have these options enabled uh, here, right here on middle and MIDI Enable MIDI remote control, enable MIDI output, and enable MIDI master sync. Now, once you have all these options enabled, you're gonna go to MIDI settings, and under under here, you're gonna see this option, Omni preview MIDI channel. Now, I have number one here by default when I plug uh, my MIDI controller and Windows install the drivers. Uh, you might have number two, number three, I don't know. But what you wanna do is uh, just uh, hold your mouse and uh, hold your cli uh, right, uh, left click and with your mouse go down until you basically select nothing like just three dots you wanna see only three dots once you have that option you wanna close this and now try to play something else on your keyboard and ready that's it now you can play any key on your keyboard on your MIDI controller and FL Studio will play any key on the sample that you have right there. So that's how you fix this issue. And I hope uh, this tutorial was uh, helpful. If you have any questions, uh, please uh, leave a comment. If you like this video, please thumb it up. And subscribe for more tutorials. Um, see you soon.